Hello everyone, once again you are welcome. Please, if this is your first time listening to us or you are just joining us, kindly support and encourage us by subscribing to this channel, turn on your notification bell so you would be notified when we have a new video posted in this channel. Thank you. So guys, as you can see in the headline of this news, Senator Ali Ndume issues a stern warning to President Bola Tinubu in an interview with Channel Television. At this point, he was actually cautioning the President against the proposed relocation of certain departments from the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, and the Federal Airport Authority of Nigeria headquarters to Lagos. So Ndume said that such a move reflects a myopic understanding of the nation, and he deeply emphasized on that decision. He said that that decision should not be made because it will look like as if uh, Nigeria is synonymous with Lagos alone. That's if you don't have Lagos, you don't have Nigeria. That's what he is trying to say in this. Uh, this the warning he sent to the president, and he argues that Lagos is, is just one part of the larger nation. Ndume goes on to express that this decision will not be accepted, and for once, the president, President Tinubu, of potential political consequences. That is, if he does that, there's going to be uh, political consequences. Uh, there will be. Uh, a, a bad effect of you know moving the headquarters to Lagos. At this point, he's actually kicking against this decision made by the president. And according to the senator, those advocating for the relocation may think they know better, but they they they, are, they lack uh, their lack of understanding about the diverse facet of Nigeria uh, could lead to unfavorable outcomes at the end of the day. So, anyways, let me just allow you. To listen to him, what he said, the warning from his mouth, what he said to the president. Now, from here, you will now understand that um, he's not, in fact, the northern, the northern part of the country is not accepting this decision, taking the Central Bank of Nigeria headquarters to, you know, to Lagos. That's Lagos is actually Yoruba and all of that. I believe uh, why Abuja is in the northern part of the country. So you see, a lot of them are now kicking against that decision. Anyways, let me allow you listen to uh, what the senator has to say, and please don't forget to drop your contribution in the comment section of this video. Let me know what you think about this decision made by the president and also this warning sent by Senator Ndume. Thank you and please don't forget to subscribe just to support and encourage us. Yes, it's not only about Northern colleagues. You know, this is a consensus because we only have one federal capital and that is Abuja. All these Lagos boys that are thinking that Lagos is Nigeria I just misinforming or advising uh, uh, the president wrongly. The regulators of the financial institutions are supposed to be or are in Abuja. Do you want them to move back to where because you say uh, uh, Lagos is the commercial uh, capital? This is one of the mistakes, and I'm sure Mr. President will reverse it because it doesn't work. Uh, you can't have two capital. Is the CBN uh, governor going to be operating from Lagos and the headquarters of the CBN is in Lagos? Or do you now say, now say that because uh, oil, ma majority of our oil is extracted from South South, you take an NPC to uh, South South? Or is it uh, because Nigeria's agricultural distance is more in the north, you take Ministry of Agri to, 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 to anywhere in the north? It doesn't work that way. And that is one of the problems that is cropping up. But I'm very sure, I'm very confident that uh, Mr. President will look at this because he's a nationalist, not uh, just a, a, a Lagos man. Some of these people think that, uh, I'll repeat, think of, some of them think that Lagos is Nigeria. Lagos is not Nigeria. Lagos is not the headquarters of uh, Nigeria. The headquarters of Nigeria is in Abuja. It's not about no, but, but, but they have because explained Abuja that this is, is no man's land. It's not a flag. This is for operational purposes. Which is operational purpose? Why was the headquarters moved from uh, Lagos to Abuja? Is it not because of the congestion? It they is are not the whole of the CBN that, that is going to be moved, Senator. I'm as, I mean, I'm just asking. Uh, the whole of the CBN yeah. is not according to the CBN. It just say uh, a unit or some unit or department is going to be relocated to their Lagos office. 
they do have a why don't you office. no 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 that that doesn't work if you have to do that if you are talking about proximity and space why don't you take them to nasarawa there or take them to kogi or take them to to, to kaduna just nearby so that you decongest the place and i even don't see any issue of congestion there is just going to be increase in cost because they will be running from uh, lagos to abuja every time is spending more uh, money you end up spending more money or uh, you know exposing our even the workers to unnecessary risk this is a decision that is not well thought out and i think the president will reverse it i'm confident of that and if that does not happen of course this is democracy we we'll know what to do and what would that be that is when the president refuses to do that what would, what would be the reaction the reaction, of course, is that right now the re reaction is we don't try to bring the issue of tribalism into it. I'm not a Hausa man, and I'm not a Fulani man, but I'm a Northerner, and I'm a Nigerian first. And we say that since the headquarters of Nigeria was removed from Lagos because of congestion and because of inefficiency to Abuja, where it's most central, and more of no man's land, because the Gwaris and the Bagis, are the, 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 the Gondora people are the only place. We have enough space there. CBN has offices that they can rent or build from in their own to increase efficiency. But moving some departments to Lagos, it's not uh, the best of uh, ideas at all. Or moving any agency on that do, matter. Do you think that this said, has some political undertone? Or it adds some other, uh, other ulterior motive? Do you think? No, 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 no. I don't want to believe that. Because I know the president that much. It's just that those political cartels that I told you that are in the corridors of power are trying to misinform the president. And we'll tell the president. The president will take action. He's someone that listens and correct anything, I'm sure he will do that. Because there's no any efficiency in it. They don't think, I mean, some of them think that they know better than everybody. They don't know anything. When you don't know Nigeria, you only know Lagos. Then you start doing things uh, as if it, it, Nigeria is Lagos. No, Lagos is in Nigeria.